story? Yes, please. Once there was a girl called Goldie. Her mother told her to buy muffins in the next door house. Go and her mother also told not to take the shortcut. And Goldilocks promised that she wouldn't take the shortcut. But Goldilocks was one of the naughtiest boys in the naughtiest girls in the world. She took the shortcut, and and there were three bears who, which lived in the forest. Goldilocks just went inside and she saw three bowls. She tasted the first bowl, but it was too hot. Then she tasted the second bowl, but it was too cold. Then she finally tasted the last bowl and it was just right, so instead she just ate all the porridge which was in the bowl. Then she felt a little bit tired, so she went to upstairs to look for some chairs. First she tried the fir first chair, but it was too high. Then she checked, uh, sat on the second chair. It was too low. Then she sat on the second, third chair and it was just right and she rocked so much that it broke into pieces. Uh oh. Hey, Papa, don't talk. <coughs> Next, she felt so tired that she went upstairs and looked at for some beds. She tried the first bed, but the head of the first bed was too high. Then she tried the second bed, but the head of that was too low. Then she tried the last bed and it had it was just right, so she went she went all fall asleep. It was good room. Meanwhile the bears came home and Papa Bear said Someone's been eating my porridge growled Papa Bear. Mama Bear said, Someone has been eating my porridge, growled Mama Bear. Someone has been eating my porridge and they ate it all up, said Baby Bear. Next they saw the chairs. Papa Bear said, Someone has been sitting in my chair. Mama Bear said, Someone has been sitting in my chair. Baby Bear said, someone has been sitting in my chair and they broke it all in pieces. Then they looked at the bed. Papa Bear said, someone has been sleeping in my bed. Mama Bear said, someone has been sleeping in my bed. Baby Bear said, someone has been sleep. someone is sleeping, someone has been sleeping in my bed and they're still sleeping in my bed. Then Goldilocks woke up. And before the bears could see who it was, Goldilocks went out of the windows. And Mama Bear said, I hope she never comes back. And Goldilocks never did. The